Now, before we go any further in this video, we're gonna do a review of safety. Uh, just for starters, uh, eye and ear protection. Uh, safety glasses are, are basically just put them on, wear them all the time. Uh, you're, you're going to want some hearing protection, whether it's those small soft ear plugs or these more, uh, the hard ear muff style. Hand protection is also important, help keep you from uh, getting cut up, um, just cuts, bruises, abrasions. When I'm normally working, I usually like a regular mechanics glove. Uh, if you're doing anything heavier, um, any kind of cutting, things like that, a heavy leather glove is a very nice way to go. And of course, if you're doing any welding, uh, welding gloves, welding helmets are a requirement. In general, long pants, long sleeve shirt, um, you want your clothing to cover your body and be able to protect you. Another thing to watch out for is a wedding ring or other jewelry. Rings are typically made out of gold, which is highly conductive, and it's on your hands, which is what you're working with. So either take it off or as a bare minimum, cover it up. A typical wrench is an excellent way to short circuit the two power posts on a battery. We don't want to do that. So what I did was I took the wrenches that I'd be using specifically for the batteries and I insulated them with heat shrink. So there we go, now we have a wrench that is uh, much less likely to short circuit a battery. The big thing is when you're working on the motorcycle, watch where your fingers are. I was actually working on the motorcycle, I didn't have any batteries hooked up to it whatsoever, but I was testing the alignment between the back sprocket and the drive sprocket. I got my finger pinched between the drive sprocket and the chain, and it was the second most painful experience in my life. This is serious stuff, you gotta be careful while working on your projects. That's it for safety. Let's get on to working on the project.